Hello. Hello. And there was evening and morning on the third full day, and God saw that it was good. In Aruba. We just had breakfast at that place right there. It's called Dushi Bagels and Burgers. Dushi means blessings here, right? It always means that. Anyway, <laughs> uh, we are gonna shop at this cool area here at the plaza. They have a lot of outdoor and indoor shops for souvenirs and other things. But yeah, we're gonna make a little shopping day for souvenirs and just make a nice day of it and then go back uh, and probably hit the beach again or, or maybe the pool for once because we haven't been there yet because we like the salt water. Hashtag salt life. Hello. Hello. We realize that we haven't done any kind of footage of the lobby area. Uh, there's a little tour of our amazing lobby. Today proves that Aruba can have clouds in the sky, yes. even if just a few. But it's almost been cloudless for the first couple days. Yeah. And here we are in the third full day. And I'm having to stay in the water because the clouds are, are making me cold. <laughs> Those those darn clouds are making me cold. We'll call that one Jack Frost. We'll call that one Frosty the Snowman. I can't see where you're pointing. <laughs> um, yeah, it's uh, about 4, 4.15. We don't have dinner reservations till... 7.15. At? At Nani's, Noni's, Nana's. No, Nana's, Nana's? <laughs> Nana's. We don't know how to say it, but it's got food there that we can eat. <laughs> Right? Yes, I'm very excited about it. It's gonna be our 15th anniversary we're gonna, dinner. We're gonna call it our 15th anniversary, even though our 15th anniversary was a month and a half ago. Not a month and a half ago. Yes, More than a month that. And a half More than ago. that. A month Definitely. and 20 some odd days Definitely ago. Definitely a month and a half ago. <laughs> so, yeah, we are excited for dinner tonight. And we've had a lovely day. We went around the plaza, which we showed you earlier. And um, now, well, and then we hung out for a little while in our room, and now we Casa, no, Casa Nona. I don't know if you can see that, but... Casa Nona. Casa Nona. It was our anniversary dinner yeah. for our 15th anniversary. That's right. So, um, we enjoyed it. He had a sea bass and enjoyed it. Yeah. And you had uh, veal ravioli. And Insert picture here. <laughs> and very much enjoyed it. And... Um, we got live music so, right now. We spent the day at the beach. What do we have for dessert? Oh, then we went up to um, the cafe here and had gelato. Gelato. And that was pretty good too. It's really good. Very, very delicious gelato. And it was just enough to satisfy, but not too much to keep us up tonight with all the sugar. Yes. And now we're just chilling out. At least. We're chilling out, listening to some live music. Yeah. And it's a beautiful night. And it's Kate. It's in a. It's Aruba. And it's 85 degrees, 84 degrees, maybe 83 now. And Casey thinks me. it's cold. And I'm like, I'm like, Casey doesn't want us to move anywhere cold like Alaska or Aruba. We're like 12 minutes from the equator. I swear, I don't know what's wrong with this woman. But okay, I love her. until next time. <laughs> We 
just rented a Jeep. Day four. Day four. Thursday, yeah. full, full day four. Yes. So we just rented a Jeep and um, we didn't want to take you through the room or all of that because rent, car rental is car rental, right? So we are now walking and seeing Baby Beach for the very first time. Yes. And Along with you. so, okay, so far, time. I'm impressed. Take a look. Okay, we just got done snorkeling at Baby Beach, at least the first shift, and it was absolutely marvelous. The footage that we just showed you is probably and hopefully okay to see something, but it was in a plastic bag, so we'll see. This is Casey. She's actually feeling a little bit motion sick, which is a role reversal for us, <laughs> at least more so than not. But we saw some really, really awesome fish. I hope you did too in the video underwater with the plastic cover. But that's our view again. We were just out where all those people are snorkeling. Not the first dark reef, but like the second dark spot. Some really cool fish. I just saw a school of probably a dozen fish, probably about the size of my hand. Some of them, most of them. But they're really pretty, kind of a light blue turquoise. Uh, so that was a real cool way to end the first shift of snorkeling today. But the weather is absolutely perfect. And we're gonna take a little break. We are at a beach that I don't know how to pronounce. Mango Alto. Mango Alto? Alto. But we're, we have to walk through mangroves and it's like kind of almost like a little cliff cave. It's really clear water. And then we walk down, there's Mrs. Casey. Hey, hey, what do you think, honey? I think it's amazing. Amazing, until next time. Beautiful downtown. Aranastad here on a Thursday afternoon. We just had lunch, did a little souvenir shopping. Yes, hey. we got a lot of things for a lot of people. <laughs> yes, namely our children. But take a look at this. So we just went to the shops there. There's the water it's right there. I'm about to go jump in, it's so high. Yeah, all kinds of stuff to do here. This is really cool. Check out these buildings. This is the Royal Plaza. Let's go in there where all the shade is and hit at some air conditioning, air conditioned stores would be nice. We give them our money sometimes if the other ones are not air conditioning. Just simple math, really. Until next time. Inside the Royal Plaza, let's go in for a closer look. I think we had to shop in the store that's playing Darling Check, playing some Hillsong. So let's take a look over here first. This is the view from the California Dunes and Lighthouse. I so believe beautiful. on the what, north western tip of the island. Look at all the sailboats. Yeah. See the hotel zone where we're staying over there. Way right over there. So, right behind us. Right? So, we decided to drive 
to the north end of the island and see the dunes and see the lighthouse. Joel thinks he wants to go up. I think I'd have a heart attack. So we'll, have to wait we'll, to see. we'll get back to you on what actually happens. another beach that we could just kind of park and walk right out so we just kicked our shoes off and it's kind of cool there's these very very cool like big rocks that are black a couple that are copper in, in color but these kind of black rocks there's also a ship out here these people are swinging off a rope watch them oh, oh there you go there they go oh crash and burn what do you think I got my feet wet <laughs> oh no well, we got but towels. I, but I found a smooth stone to take home. Okay, Add clear, to our collection. You're gonna smuggle that through customs? I'm gonna smuggle it. Don't okay. tell anyone. Look at that sunset. Ooh, yeah. So pretty. We're, we're kind of below, we're down the hill from the lighthouse. And there was another beach down that way. And this is kind of the second one. You can see there's people even on the other side of this kind of hill. I think there's a whole other stretch of beach over there. I kind of wanted to snorkel again, but she just doesn't want to get have to get wet again. Uh, get our suits on and everything. The suits are wet. Yeah. So. But the snorkeling was great today, and I bet it'd be kind of cool here as well. I see people out there snorkeling right now. Um, but anyway, just a lovely, lovely evening. There's the hotel zone where we're staying, right around there, and. We're gonna eat a late dinner. It's already, what, 6.30 or so, and we're not really hungry at a late lunch. We're just enjoying these amazing Arubian views. Arubian nights. And he's working on Italian, so he's he almost has six was languages. Born and raised on this island. We said, "Where are you from?" He said, "Born and raised on the island." Yes. So, so he was great. Until next time. So we're walking back to the car after dinner tonight, and there is a bizarre. It's very bizarre, as you can <laughs> see. It's basically just. It's basically just a tourist tourist trap, but we love. But portable. It's like a porto trap. Like One happy island. <laughs> but yeah, this is really cool though. It's really gorgeous outside because there's a breeze coming through where we are standing right now. And it uh, feels wonderful. We're, we're ready to go back and yeah. take showers and chill. Been a very awesome, fun, busy day in the sun and out of the sun. And it was awesome. Till next time.